Hi guys, this is a video on a program called Game Save Manager. Now this is useful for those of you who have a bunch of games on your system that you've played through for a while and you've saved your progress, but suddenly you need to format your system for some reason or you need to transfer those games onto another computer. That's where Game Save Manager comes in. It basically is a backup and restore tool for your saves of your games. So the great thing about Game Save Manager is that it's actually been created by one of our own insane Matt. He's a member of the Mob3 forum. So I'll be able to provide you with a link to the post that he's made on the Mob3 forum where you can provide him with feedback or you can contact him directly if you need to. He's actually looking for people to uh, give requests on certain games to be put into the program so they're officially supported. Currently there are 73 supported games which I will show you in just a second. So that is the Mob3 forum post which I will link in the description. Now before I start I must mention that I'm actually on my girlfriend's computer so I'm not on my own. There's only one game installed on this computer and that's Trackmania Nations Forever. So I'm going to go ahead and click this game save manager and we're going to see it as it starts up. If we go to file and then list supported games you can see it's opened a text document that has all the supported games that are here. Now a lot of them are the really popular ones so we've got Bioshock here, we've got Battlefield, we've got Call of Duty, Crisis, uh, Grand Theft Auto, uh, Prototype, TeamSpeak's even here and also Trackmania Nations Forever which is what I need to back up right now. So if your game isn't actually in that list so if you're not in one of the 73 but you know how to get to it and you know how to do it yourself go ahead and click that custom game save entry and then you can add it in yourself and it will back it up for you into a file and then you can restore it later I'll show you the process but that's just a quick explanation so I'm going to go ahead and back up my game save I'm going to click it, it's just gone straight through, it's detected my game Trackmania Nations Forever, it's given me a warning so I'm going to click it and it says it contains skin and track caches to name a few so backup size may be large, that's not a problem for me so it's just detected it, it's just shown where it's actually located as you can see not my computer and uh, it's asking about a Steam username and Steam community ID which I am not going to set at the moment because obviously my girlfriend doesn't have one so it doesn't really matter at this point so I'm just going to go ahead and click start backup as you can see it's saving it as a GSBA file, Game Save Backup Archive. Now when you go to install this Game Save Manager game, it will ask you if you want to associate those files with Game Save Manager. I suggest you do that so then you can just double click and it will open up in the program and get ready to restore with your games. So I'm just going to click save and that's it. It's just backed up, it's done and there it is. This is the Game Save Manager backup and I can then put this onto a pen or back it up anywhere, put it on some online storage or something and then I can restore it later on. So that's exactly what I want to do with all the games on my computer at home if I ever need to format them. Uh, this is suggested for those of you who just want to, who I suggest to just back up now. If you have any issues with your computer right now, what about your game saves? Will they disappear? So go ahead and back them up now with Game Save Manager. So thanks for watching my video. If you have any suggestions again, go to that post on Mob3, you'll find everything you need to know. You also find a change log from Insane Matt of specific things that he's added, for various operating systems, and any extra features that he has also added. So, again, thank you for watching my video. Please comment, rate, subscribe if you like my videos, and thanks again.